Hey, what's up, people? Welcome back to New York Mysteries High Voltage. We're heading back to Samuel's house. The wiring puzzle. Alright, so now one of the switches is missing. This one. And connect the nodes with wires as shown in the diagram. The red wires on top. Like this. Aha! Alright, here. Inside this... It's like a workshop. There's a vault door. What the heck? Must find the long's rotating mechanism. Yeah, definitely not a usual basement. <laughs> Look at this place. Need a clue showing the positions of these switches. Don't have it. Now, that is a safe. We need a combination here. Try to crack the safe. Maybe using a stethoscope. Can get to the table with the water and the broken electrical wire. So how do I turn this off? Um. But here's a pickaxe. Maybe going back to the station. Remember those tunnels. Um, right here. Yeah, cement bucket. So we have the rubber boots now, and that means we can cross that water, the electrified water. Yep. Another slide. Corkscrew. It's for the barrel. I'm going back and forth. I'm so glad that I can quick travel in this game. Otherwise, I would spend ages moving around different places. Alright, picture of wine. Red wine. Jack of wine? Oh, the pitcher. Okay. Add the remove or pour wine from vessel to vessel to obtain four measures of wine. Okay, so... So five... Two and three... Um... Let's put this back. So three on this side now. Three. Put this in. One. I got it. So... One plus three, that's four. There we go. Lockpick set. Again, let's quick travel. Back to the apartment. There are four locks. Choose right lockpick for each lock. So, this is trial and error. And the last one. So inside is the clue for the wavelength puzzle. Alright, back down to the basement now. The three knobs. It's gonna be three, maybe this one? Yeah, it is that one. But the distance between the two... Wait, there's only one. So, they overlap? Yeah, that is the one. <laughs> Another envelope. Bows and hairpins made her day until her suffering took her away. They all rhyme. Envelope number four and the clock hand. Okay, the time is right here. So, yeah, 155 or 255. Let's try 2. 
Is that right? Yeah, right there. The last envelope. Glasses used to conceal her sight. Now her eyes see endless night. So five clues for five ladies here. Decorate each mannequin with the required accessory. The accessories are in the envelopes with hands. Okay, so she always held her teddy so tight. Now they sleep in the eternal night. It's this one. This girl with a vinyl collection now sleeps in silent reflection. Girl number one. He never said his oath to the bride. Instead, he walks with death by his side. Obvious. It's the bride. Glasses used to conceal her sight. Now her eyes see endless night. The blind lady. Bowls and hairpins made her day until her suffering took her away. Bow. <laughs> this giant bow on her head. No big hands with floppy rims can ever atone for her mortal sins. What did she do? Whoa! All turned into ashes now. Turning mechanism. That is for the save? The vault doors. It's not the save. Whoa, it's like a secret room. It's a panic room. So, another one of these lights? It's the same one found in the prison. The device is missing some parts. Like what? Uh, this is not opening. Hmm. Got a long hook? Grab the magnet. And inside here is a glove, plastic glove. So, what does that do? Oh, cut wire. Did repair that. And missing knob. Okay, diagram. The sheet of paper with a clue. Paper clip. Um. Use that as a log peg. Could use this tie as a robe. So why can I grab it now? Why? Okay, now let's go back to the wires. Use our safety gloves. Let's twist them back together. And is it working? Yes. And here's a one light bulb, can reach that, use our magnet. Uh, <laughs> no, it's not magnetic. <laughs> Never mind. But where is the second light bulb? It's gotta be somewhere around here. Okay, yeah, let's look at this device again. Ooh, there's a switch. Let's see this before. So we can put it back here and use our clue. Set the switches in the correct positions using diagram. So, the red line. Voila! So, second light bulb. One. Is it on the tie? Oh! So we have a elongated magnet now. <laughs> we can grab the light bulb. So this is going to... Aha! Uh -huh, open the panel! A picture of Samuel. An heir to Tesla. New task. What is that about? Uh, the picture goes back here. That empty space. A bottle? Today is an important day. I found a way to help my son. I will utilize my knowledge of Nikola Tesla's experiments to convert living matter into energy ether. I will transfer him through space and then convert him back. This way I can take Hugo out of prison. 
will leave this place and I'll heal him. He will become a good, kind boy. I truly believe this. Well, guess what? It's now a nightmare. Your son is not turning back. Okay, the Bono. Hmm, it's a weird shape. And I guess I have to go back to the wine cellar. Remember there is a missing bottle there. Yeah, right here. It's a wine collection. A range of bottles is shown on the diagram. This one. Just follow the shapes. Should be pretty easy. On the bottom row, so that's one, two, three, and exchange is two. And there we go. Compartment at the back. Frederick, the heir of the younger branch of Montmorency family. An ancient line built this cellar in honor of his great grandfather. Frederick's grandfather owned a huge vineyard in Montmartre. After he joined the order, Frederick felt obliged to recreate a piece of the land he held so dear. After, after he joined the order, Frederick felt obliged to recreate a piece of the land he held so dear. And we have hand switch now. So again, we are going to quick travel. And that goes here, right? It's a wine press. Uh, wait, the switch is not for this. Really? Let's look at our map. The main hall. Is it really missing a switch? But anyway, Bishop is here. Let's talk to him again. So this means that Samuel created the device using Tesla's technology. Hmm, that's quite interesting indeed. One of the Order's neophytes works at the old Tesla laboratory. I think we can destroy Hugo in his new form only by using a device similar to his father's. Take this keycard. Use our tunnel network to get there quickly. And that's where we are it now. So back to the tunnel again. Right there. Is it blocked? Oh. So now here is the laboratory. Moving object. And right here in the puddle of water is a saw. Um, cannot go into the water. Why? <laughs> it's not even electrified. Why can't I go in? I'm afraid of water. <laughs> okay, what is this? I picked up something here. So the front gate. Judging by the size, the gate might be alive. Might be light? Before I touch it, I better check it with some metal object. This. Yep, it is alive. It is under high voltage. I must de-elect voltage. I must de-electrify it before I touch it. Uh, use this panel. Switch controls the gate's power supply. Need to turn it off. And I have a switch right here. And now it is off. We are going in. Oh, not yet. <laughs> have to test this again. Yep. De-electrified. <laughs> 